what's inside the February Champions Club box for Major League Fishing? Let's find out. Hey guys, welcome back to the channel and welcome back to the vlog. Do me a favor, click that thumbs up and hit that subscribe button. Also comment below and tell me what you think. And if you're a member, one of you guys are gonna get this. I think you're gonna be pretty happy. If you don't know about Major League Fishing and the Champions Club box, it's a monthly subscription box. It gets five or six, seven lures every month. Uh, they're generally pretty good. I was disappointed last month. I'm hoping this is a better month for them. It's $29.99, that includes shipping. It's a really good price. It's one of the lower priced ones. And like I said, you generally get some pretty darn good uh, tackle in this. What you also get is you get a little card about one of the anglers in, in the Bass Pro Tour, but you also get a like a discount code card where you'll get some discounts and also an opportunity to watch some videos about each product that is in here. And that's another thing that's completely different than any of the other subscription boxes. So let's find out what's inside of it. Before we do that, we're gonna look at it three ways. We're gonna look at the fishability of the, of the box. Then we're gonna look at the number two will be the quality or the brand names, because that's important to me. That's very important to me. While I want new stuff, I want good stuff. I don't want stuff I can go around the corner to a store I don't want to even name and get knocked off. I don't like that kind of stuff. Third, we're gonna look at the value. Is it a good value? Because I, th I think value is important. Because I mean, truth be told, these lures cost them a couple bucks for them to buy. If they give me six of them and maybe they got 15 bucks into the whole box. And I don't think, that, I know they should make money, but I don't want to get a box that's, you know, you pay 40 bucks for it and you get $42 worth. Because I can just go around the corner and buy at the crappy store. I can go buy all those, those products myself. So I want a good value in here. So without further ado, here is the exclusive club discounts. You can see right there. You guys want to use those go ahead it also tells us the six products that are in here and it looks like they're gonna be pretty good oh they give you a value too I'll see if that works and they also give you the card Brent Ayler this dude can fish I like that dude so I'm gonna put that one over here and this one over here to start us off they gave us a ducket rattlin lipless crankbait I know a little bit about this one, and here's why. I think Boyd and the team got with Bill Lewis at Rattle Trap because they wanted to have the same pitch that the Rattle Trap had, or something close to it. So, while probably not one that you've got in your box, it's a pretty good. This is a pretty good lure. Next, I love these baits, soft plastics. This is the Rage Denny Crab. I think that's from. Uh, that's this is a this is a fantastic product. I think Rage Crab makes uh, Rage Tail makes a, a magnificent product. I even like the scent, even though this might be a surprise to y'all. I've never drank a cup of coffee in my whole life, but fantastic bait, fantastic trailer, catches fish. Next, they gave us a. Strike King Finesse Jig. And I have a lot of jigs, but I guess you can always use another one. Still all right. I think it's a, a decent product and it is a Strike King, so that's good. The Boy Ducket Water Lash, or Water Slash, Water Slash. Great bait. Uh, runs true and quite honestly in the month of March this is the bait I, this is a bait that I'm going to use smaller profile I'll, I'll have to trim the skirt but still a good bait really a good bait 3 8 ounce and, and a, a bait that you can catch fish on here's a surprise they sent a hybrid hunter from Strike King hey now the Todd Castle dying uh, or Todd Castle Dean however you say his last name 
bait. Runs shallow, great action, good sound, floating version. This is a winner. I'm very happy about that one. And then last but not least, they gave us the, the Six Sense Hyper Jerk 70 slash bait, I think, or suspending or floating twitch bait. I guess, yeah, it's a jerk bait. Not bad. You know, Six Sense makes great products. Six Cents is on top of the game. So that's what's in this month's February box for Champions Club for Major League Fishing. So let's look at the fishability. I'm going to be able to fish this. I'm going to be able to fish this. To be honest, everything is fishable. Everything in here is fishable. Everything. Uh, on a 1 to 10, I'm going to give this... Only because I have so many jigs lately, I don't know what to do with. I'm going to give this a 9644. And here's why. I've never used 4, and I don't think any of the ratings, so I'm using it twice, and that's why I want to do. What do you think? I want to hear. Next, in terms of the quality of products, I think everything in here is pretty good. I think people are going to probably take... Uh, I think if there's any knock on it, the ducket stuff might take a little bit of a knock. Um, for me, that doesn't really matter because I know I've used a lot of the ducket fishing stuff and I've caught a lot of fish on all of the products. And I know that they do the research and try to do things a little bit innovative. And while they're probably not doing anything innovative in the two lures I got here, they're still good quality. And that smaller water slash is perfect size for March when the fish are going to move, start moving up. Down here, they're moving, they're they're getting into the springtime. Up there, and where they've not spawned yet, they're they're going to move to ledges and stuff. And that bait is deadly in March. So in terms of the quality of products, I'm going to say it's another 9534, just to keep with the four. And then... Um, <laughs> And then in the overall value, oh, we can tell. I paid $29.99 for this, and that includes shipping. And they say the total value is $48.14. Can you see that? Now, what I'll do is I'm going to put my value, what it cost me, right here. And you'll hear a little bling. And then I'm going to go look it up on Tackle Warehouse, Tackle Warehouse and find it exactly. Not, You know what? I'm not going to Tackle Warehouse. We did this with Bass Fades Month, and we got to keep it real. We got to keep it the same. I'm going to go online and try to try to find each bait for the least amount of money I can, and then put the value here because that's what we need to do. Now, I'm not saying if you went someplace else, you'd have to buy shipping and that kind of stuff, but you can probably go to your local tackle store and go, you know, I found this for four dollars. Can you give it to me for four dollars? And they would say yes. And sometimes I suggest doing that, but. Let's see what the overall value is over here. Thanks for hitting that like and subscribe button. Make sure you comment below and tell me what you think. And members, members who have hit that join button, when you get this box too. So, thank you. Comment below and tell me what you think. Give me your rating. Give me your fishability. Give me your brand. Uh, the quality of brand. Tell me what you think. I want to know. If I'm off, we need to have a conversation. And that's all right. It's all right to have a difference of opinion. I want to know it. It helps me be better because I just try to give you my honest opinion. I try to keep it real as much as possible. I think some of you guys know that because of my weird facial tics. And they are weird facial tics, let's be honest. Don't say you like my crazy eyes and stuff like that. I understand. I'm not the most, the best looking guy on the face of the earth. I'm not Scotty Martin. That guy's a good looking dude. But I try to keep it real with you. So thanks. Remember, take a kid fishing. Get your fish on. Point now. Thank you. Cheers. Hit like and subscribe. Take your own kids fishing.